Hello everyone, this is Satya from Tech One Engineering Service. So in this video, we will see in Revit how the project parameter are able to create and how it is going to be included in the respective panel or respective wall. Okay, let's move on to the topic. So here you are able to see the wall. If I select the wall, outside we are able to see some properties like or the parameters like product number with simply a panel number and if I click on to edit type inside also we are able to see some set of datas or the parameters so the datas are the parameter which I am able to see directly or set to be the instance parameter and the parameter which I am able to see just by clicking to edit and coming up back to the type property that are all set to be the type parameter I will just how to create instant parameter and type parameter too so first thing i'm just moving on to top you are able to see a tab manage then select the project parameter once if i click on to the project parameter here you are able to see some set of identity data or parameters are available so but now we are going to create is a new parameter i'm going to click on to add once click on to add this dialog box will open in this box on left hand side top you are able to see what kind of parameter I'm going to use is that going to be project parameter or is that going to be the shared parameter shared parameter is the one in which we are able to create one of the parameter in this project and I'm able to use the same parameter in the another project just by clicking a button export so now we will create a project parameter first I selected the project parameter and let it be we will have as a type parameter now so I'm just going to click on to assembly because we need to select the category which we have to define the category should be interrelated to the data which we are going to include suppose here I'm just going to include the data on the wall assembly so that's the reason I choose assembly then I make this as a manufacturing cost I'm just going to add this data for the panel so it's type and category let it be common and in text I'm just going to select currency and this is done ok so now if I click on to ok you are able to see this manufacturing cost is converted and now included in the project parameter list which is not available before if I click on to ok now this has been added in the panel I selected the wall that is assembly wall it is a type parameter right so I, I want to click on to edit if I look on to the type data that is the element data you are able to see the manufacturing cost is now added but I want to add the value means first I need to set the unit the exact presentation how I so I'm just going to make it as zero decimal done so for this wall I'm just going to add the cost like uh, say thousand dollar so if I select this wall if I want to extract data this value will be generated automatically so that's the reason we are creating the parameter which is more important for data extraction and now we will look on to how the instant parameter work type parameter we already saw the same thing for instant parameter also clicking on to the project parameter I'm just going to add a new parameter so add and then project parameter and this one done then I have to select its assembly code so assembly instance to know in which sequence the panel are going to cast it so it is let it be I want this data to view on outside itself so I just selected instant discipline let it be common and on text lot 1 lot 2 means I am able to give text itself so assembly is selected ok so now you are able to see the casting sequence which we created the parameter now included I am click on to ok now if I select the wall you are able to see the casting sequence is created we are able to see clearly the casting sequence that is the text is created and even I am here I am able to enter a slot 1 so so that we will be aware while I am extracting the data these are all the priority panel that is a lot 1 sequence panel also generated so that's the reason we just created as an instant parameter and the manufacturing cost for each panel is also created using type parameter by using this method we are able to create the data which we are going to extract 
and we are going to provide as a building information model and thank you all